Hello, and welcome back to Doom. This is being done a little bit late. But oh well, things are what they are, after all. <clears throat> Last episode, we, uh... Oh god, what did we do last episode? We got the BFG. And we headed to the Lazarus Labs to try and find the, uh, the Helix Stone so that way we can potentially shut down the portal. And either this episode or the last episode, or either the last episode of this would be before. You'll find the Helix Stone in Olivia's private archival lab deep within this facility. Few have ever seen the stone. But if you came to us for a reason, you might be able to see something in it we haven't. So. Um, either last episode or the episode before, we also met Hayden in the flesh, which or in the chrome. Um, he's tall, man. I I stood on that table without even realizing I was standing on the table until I looked down, just because it's my instinct to try and make my character height the same as theirs. Like I'm trying to look him at him in the eye, so I didn't even realize I did that. I just did it <laughs> without thinking. Um, that being said. There's clearly some demonic bullshit going on here, and we're going to deal with it. But first, health. It is not a mistake that he has come into our possession. The demons prophesized his return. If he wakes, it could jeopardize the entire mission. They're talking about me. For he is the only one who can stand against them. And someone awoke me. Who, I'm not sure, but someone did. Let's check our map and our objectives. Perform five different glory kills on possessed soldiers. Kill five demons with a single shot. And play a game of demon destruction. There it is. Hmm. Now that's where I came from. Got very turned around. My bad. The hell? There will be an open forum to resolve any questions or concerns on the initiative to weaponize the demons. Report to the chapel in 1400 hours. Please save your work before attending. Yeah, no, they're making cultists and crap. But we found a new weapon the siphon grenade. Design. Oh, come on. Stay focused. There you go. The siphon grenade was designed to work with the Doom Marines Predator suit specifically to make use of the Argent receptors found in the gloves and chest plates. It has three stages. When primed, it releases positively charged particle field around itself in the hand. Then, when the grenade is released, it explodes, releases a negatively charged particle field, uh, attracts plasma from any demon caught in the radius, tearing the plasma from the cells. Finally, the positively charged suit attracts the cloud and gathers the plasma. If I can fucking read it. Uh, partially healing the Doom Marine. So basically this is my best grenade. I might actually use this. Where's the button to change 
the um, equipment F1 and F2 wait huh what does that do I don't know whatever um Yeah, siphon grenade is my plan. Make sure there's nothing I missed. There isn't. Cool. Let's go. And again. These guys are just... Oh. They're cultists is what they are. Demons got a cult. Demons got a cult. Demons got a cult. Demons got a cult. Gonna go and take care of the demon cult. Gonna take care of the demon cult. Bam. Bam. Do -do -do -do. Cultist get the fist. Hello, Pinky. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's not my hotspot button. Uh, G is? Yeah, G is. Bye bye, Pinky. You did, you did, you did, you did try at least. Ammo crate. Bam. I need that a lot. Need a lot of that. Mm -hmm. Mega health. The heck is that? Stimulant is the first and so far only successful fusion of UAC technology in the arcane science bind the Argent Stimulants. When consumed, it bestows additional stamina and endurance on the user, effectively giving them more life. The effect is first achieved by vaporizing, then ionizing an adrenaline solution, which is then injected into a demagnetized Argent Stimulant. As the resulting concoction is extremely volatile, the product must be absorbed immediately to avoid combustion. It is notable that the stimulant can be administered to humans successfully, although it does shorten overall lifespan significantly. Attempts to administer the solution to demons have proven unsuccessful. The demon suffers agonizing death moments after ingestion. So we know we're not demons, at least. I gotta shut down that maw. And so I shall. Let the gauntlet begin. Oh, you jumpy boy. Super shotgun. Die, 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 die to hell. To hell. To hell. And bam. 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 That was overkill. There goes the head. Mancubus. Come on. Presence has not been eliminated, it's just.
Oh, this is the where I was supposed to go, I guess. Oh well. Praetor tokens. So let us increase the equipment recharge time. I think I've acquired. No, I didn't read it. Database Elite Guard. There we go. UAC employees are advised to comply with any orders received from the Elite Guard. Their jurisdiction is absolute, answering only to the highest level executives of the UAC. If an Elite Guard can request you accompany them to the labs, you are going to the labs. With such powerful capabilities in each guard, it would be deemed unnecessary uh, to implant a kill chip in each uniform, so they might be controlled should an uprising occur. The kill chip response to a Lazarus have signature that can only be broadcast by Satan, Hayden, or Pierce. And I'm guessing Miss Olivia triggered their deaths. Knowing her. I mean, I already have a lot of these, so I guess I'll go with Oh, this is better. Yeah, that's way better. What what is this? It might be health or something. I don't know what it is. I don't like the sound of that. were the worst thing. The Corax tablets discovered during the UAC automated survey of 2143 mentioned an ancient battle in the Titan's realm during a third age. An expedition to the plains recovered several relics, including the petrified remains of a massive shadow lord believed to be an ancient Balgar demon. Researchers at the Lazarus Labs began work on piecing the creature back together. At first, the project mandate was to construct an educational, inspirational exhibit. However, the focus quickly shifted when 
An attempt to meld the petrified situ and cover the exposure to small doses to plasmatic argent energy would reanimate the relic. The potential of creating a living, growing tissue from the relic in the lure of an ultimate battle demon was too enticing to pass up. The odd project team then quickly shifted direction and began work on melting the ancient remains with high-tech weaponry. That's bad. That's real bad. That's real bad. Because I should still have everything else that I've already collected. I do. I know I'm being quiet, it's because I'm just, I'm focusing. Um, what the fuck? That thing better not be awake. We're gonna have problems if that thing's awake. Mark my words. Uh, health station. I'm gonna need everything I can before I go in here. Oh, I hear you, zombie boys. I hear you. Um. Um. I. Am. Extremely concerned. And more than a little bit terrified. Wait, I missed a. Th I missed several things. Yeah, I'm not jumping down there yet. I missed some stuff. I'll be back. I'll be back, guys. I didn't go downstairs. Wait, what's here? Oh, I have to open that. Yeah, I was so busy being, like, freaked out by the weird noises that I didn't bother. Oh, actually... I don't think I did miss anything. Because it doesn't... look like any of these things are accessible. Yeah, none of these things are accessible. Okay. I guess I didn't miss it. Because it's just not available to access, I'm assuming. I guess I am going down there then. I 
I'm guessing that there will be a way. Once I descend the level, there'll be a way to get there. I'm assuming there will be at least. Oh, that is just glass. Huh. Oh, here it is. Well, that's some cool music, but... Oh, no, 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 no. I don't have time for this, mace. Come on, you bloody foes. I've got just the thing for you. I got just the thing to murder you all. Go back to hell. All of ye. Go back to the pit. From whence thou came. Whoa, I didn't even mean to move that far. They made their own portal. Oh, I didn't know that's how that worked. That would have been really useful. In the uh, elevator battle. Oh, thank God this thing's still dead. Oh, that was a Mancubus. That was a Cyber Mancubus that they were putting together. Oh, that's not that big of a deal. I don't like that. I like how there was a four times damage there, but I didn't need it because I just BFG'd. Now I'm running out of ammo. Come on. Damned pinkies. Come on. 
here we go. Okay, now the imminent death is no longer a thing. I'm so low on a lot of ammo. It's time to use my, uh... I mean, I'm gonna keep on going, man. I'm not gonna use my chainsaw until I run out of everything. And, of course, I can't go that direction either. I may have locked myself out of part of the level. Oh well. If I did, I did. Weapon upgrades, so for starters. Reduce transformation time, penetrate through targets. And then it's just faster reload the only thing left. It's literally the only upgrade I have left other than energy efficient for the uh, rifle. And of course the pistol stuff, but the pistol stuff's irrelevant. This. Okay. 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 All right. These all got to die. No. No, it won't. Samuel saw Olivia as a protege. He sponsored her. Yada yada. Um, Olivia's career blossomed, and Samuel eventually offered the freedom to design and run her own cutting edge laboratory. She refused, citing she had no interest in the energy business. When she did finally leave Lanostruck, it came as a shock to the community. She relinquished the position of a sizable power and control to work at an isolated outpost 140 million miles from work. A former colleague of Olivia at Nanostruck stated that Samuel sent her an artifact recovered near the Argent Fracture, after which she became obsessed with joining the UAC. After a few weeks later, she accepted the offer and came leader of the Lazarus Project, working directly under Hayden. Ha, huh, chain gun upgrade, but whatever. So I have... I don't know, I thought it said I had something. Let's get that upgrade. Maxed out health, man. More armor. All right, let's hit the button. Good. Uh, 
Ooh, it made it turn red. That seems like that was a bad idea. I need that. Whatever that thing is, I need it. The Crucible. That's what she was looking for. Vega, did you get the location? Yes. It is located in an uncharted region of the Titan's realm. But we'll need to rupture another Argent accumulator to create the portal. The only accumulator in this sector is in specimen CD-587. <laughs> You're going to have to remove it. Once you've extracted the accumulator, it will become unstable. The ruptured casing should cause a rift strong enough to send you back to their world. We can determine your point of entry using the tether system I uploaded to your suit. Retrieving the crucible is critical. Without it, we have no way of shutting down the well and closing the hell portal here on Mars. Well, I got that. Ow. Uh, what the hell? I didn't do that. I didn't make that movement. If that wasn't obvious enough. Shotgun, no. Pass rifle, no. Uh, sure. What the fuck is going on? Hayden, have you been screwing around with my suit when I'm not paying attention? Oh, hey, buddy. I needed ammo. Rocket launcher again. Go the Kako Demon. Imp. Looks like just imps left. I also have to point out there's moments where I don't even know what I'm doing. I just do them without thinking. Like, I'll rewatch these videos and I'll be like, how the hell did I do that? <laughs> I'm not that good, but clearly I am because I've done it. Um, and it's recorded. I didn't even get to use the chain gun. It only has 10 ammo. Uh, 
That's interesting. I used the chain. I used all of my chainsaw, and I got no ammo for it. I would have thought it would have given me ammo. I guess I thought wrong. Uh, okay. I guess this is that chapel they spoke of. Truly horrible. You're like, oh my god, what the fuck? It's all jacked. I'm like, yeah, no, I was expecting this. This was 100% expected. again or your horn piece of crap Now this is new. Lazarus wait at full charge, ready for activation. This helm will redirect the course of mankind. On this day, we make our contribution to their cause. Our salvation lies with them. I pulled you from that tomb in the Cadenger Sanctum for this reason. I know she was weak. Our work doesn't come without risks, and I released you from your prison to help mitigate those risks. I knew that in the event of a catastrophe, you'd be the only thing that could stop them. You should have awoken me earlier, Hayden. Good. Portal shut. Health pack. Directly injected into my veins. Door. Open. Pathway. Clear as zombies. Or, but not of these idiots. Yeah. Wow, really? Ammo. But 
Do I have any chain? Yes, it can be chain gun ammo. So it's the thing for the chain gun. It removes overheat. Uh, uh -huh. Kill four or more demons during single mobile turret. And I gotta find the security station. Which is not that big of a deal. I'll go this way. Actually, no, I won't. I will go... Oh, no, that was the doorway that was locked. Okay, I'll go this way. Yep. Hi, boys. I'm here. Oh, I overheated. You know, that happens really quickly, doesn't it? Maybe I should have four times damage first before I try and get that. Because the achievement's for four or more demons five times. So, with that being acknowledged, two, three, Four and then and then one, two, three, and four, and one, two, three, four. There we go. And I'm out of ammo, so that's what that plan was. And then switch back to the and plasma rifle board. Actually, uh, super shotgun. Again, the weird gravity. Really annoying. Yeah, I'm aware that it's on unsafe levels. I'm currently dealing with that problem right now. Because these imps keep on trying to run away from me. All they're doing is giving me more sport. And I'm just making a loop of the level. God damn, Pinky. I hate these fucks. Ah, son of a 
There we go. Dealt with all of them. And I only need four more. That's all I need. Well, I need uh, two... Six, seven, eight. I need eight more, technically. I think I don't have his health. All right. I'm ready. As ready as I'm going to be. Let's face our greatest challenge yet. Oh. My. God. He just did that. Hi, buddy. Hey. You're going to have some fun. Oh, God, he has a boss bar. Hi. You are one of the demon lords of hell. You and I are going to have some fun. You see, I eat demon lords like you for breakfast. I mean, look at you. You haven't even landed a single shot on me, and I've got you down to half health. This is really anticlimactic. I thought you'd be a greater challenge, my dude. See, the trick is rocket launch him to death. Fortunately, I've decided that I want to have playtime, because you have not yet shown yourself to be a legitimate threat. Look, they even given me BFG in the corner. Yep. It's all about just avoiding your attacks and blowing you up with a rocket launcher. Bye bye, demon. I would say it's been fun, but you really weren't that much of a challenge. <laughs> Back to hell. God, okay. 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 Now you're now you're a problem. All three BFG blasts. Hell yes I will. I will absolutely use the weapons I normally don't use on this guy. That was a... Uh... Nah, I'm not going to waste that. I will use the chain gun, though. No, 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 I won't, because I'm trying to save up chain gun. Uh... Alright, your hell version's uh, a little bit more interesting. You did destroy absolutely all of my armor and a lot of my health. But I haven't been red zoned yet. And I've already killed you not only once, but I'm about to kill you twice. So, well, I am out of rocket ammo. No, I'm not. I just swapped out of it for some reason. Alright, 
Time to cut your head off. With your own damn horn. Now stay dead. You were fucking terrifying. At least at first, but... A second entry. Oh no, first entry. Considered to be the most significant marker of success in the development of Argent Organic Research, the Cyber Demon is the flagship creation of Lazarus Project, the symbolic union of a Balgar demon found during the second Lazarus manned expedition and an Argent accumulator. The beast is capable of withstanding so much punishment the creature must be kept in permanent suspended animation. Repeated attempts to subdue the beast prove unsuccessful, as when exhausted, the Cyber Demon simply replenishes its life force from the accumulator and attacks again with greater ferocity. Only by removing the implant can the beast be restrained. The Cyber Demon retains, or sorry, remains in stasis until a suitable method of control can be found. But you're not going to find one, because he's a demon. One of the Demon Lord's greatest servants. And that is the end of that level. I know I missed uh, Demon Destruction. Sorry. I didn't stumble across it in my playthrough. <laughs>